Hi guys, Rob here with Deluxe Gaming, and welcome back to Reassembly! This is now the official launch of my Season 2 of Reassembly. Season 1 was so much fun, and the Insectoid race was just a blast, but I feel that we've learned enough about the game that we should be starting over to try something new. Besides, we've got the new races as well, so, you know, there's all sorts of new content that we haven't, nobody's seen yet, including myself. Um, except, you know, these guys, you guys that actually own the game already that have gone through all of these, I'm sure, like four times already. But, I have not. So, there's been a lot of discussion on the channel as to which race we should play, and it's really been a mixed bag, and everybody, you know, has been picking one thing or another, and, um... On that note, I just decided to pick this color, uh, or this this particular race. Now, it's one of the races that we had trouble fighting against as the insectoid race, so I don't know, I thought that was kind of interesting. And um, it it looks cool, and somebody had mentioned that there's something about custom guns or something. Anyway, I don't know, I, it doesn't really matter which race we play, because I think we might be exploring more than just one or two anyway. So uh, I guess now we get to pick our, our color. And uh, so this, the first color determines yeah, I, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. As I've said before, I am terrible at picking colors, but I think we go with something a little bit more... Not blue. Red would be okay. Orange. Oh, that's different. That's different. But look, it's still got, still got purple in there, eh? I guess uh, the purple kind of stays. Blue. No, not blue. Oh kind of like that orange. I kind of like it. If we find the right color to go with it, it would be kind of cool. The blue? Nah, it's a green. I really like green. Oh, kind of a darker color. I don't know how well that would record. Ooh. Ooh. Then we do kind of a bright... Oh. It's changing color. As I'm sitting here, it's changing color without touching anything. That orange is kind of... Yeah, so you notice how it rotates in color? Now, there has been, uh, on the latest patch, they, they included the different races, but they also added a whole bunch of other stuff too as well. Added and changed a whole bunch of other stuff, and I haven't read it through thoroughly. What do you think of that, guys? I think that looks pretty neat. I don't know. I hope that records well. And I just threw a name down here. I don't know what the theme of this series is going to be. It, it probably will be something similar to the Insectoid race. In other words, I'm going to pick a theme and I'm going to go with it. And, uh, oh, <gasps> looks familiar. Yes, so these are the same. Oh, uh, yes, yes, yes. Click, click, click. Yes, we don't need the tool tips or all these chips. It's the same race that uh, we were fighting at the end. Actually, I think the last ship to kill us was actually this race. Is that ever cool? So I wonder, actually, if we can find or actually fight against this the original race the blue and the pink one in this game now because we have chosen them as as our home race so oh wow look at and the ships are huge wow because i remember these 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 are like stations right whoa okay so uh the weapons let's just take a look at our ship so let's take a look at our start, starting ship Yes, 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 we don't need all this. You guys know how to play the game now. If you don't, let me know, and I will do another tutorial. would be happy to do that. Um, if you are new to the game, please check out my episode one of the previous series, which is Vectored Space Romping. Um, otherwise, uh, yeah, I don't think we need to go through an entire tutorial here again. Antimatter. So, yeah, one of the greatest things about this game, it is so cool. The parts... And the weapons are different for every single race. So get this. So this looks like it's a defense gun. It's a plasma dif diffractor. <laughs> an auto-firing projectile weapon. Okay, and it's probably very similar to the defense gun. And an antimatter anti missile launcher. And that's it. That's all I have on this ship. That's crazy. And look, the, the parts are different. The parts are totally different. Like, it's a different kind of triangle. Um... That is a isos no, not an isosceles. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, you math, you math junkies will probably know. Um, this is like it's a, like a trapezoid again, but it's uh, it's a little bit different. Everything's a little bit different. So the designs we're going to be able to. Oh, I can. I already have some awesome ideas. Uh, so I haven't picked a theme, but yeah, that it's. Oh, weird. 
Weird. I think I'm just gonna have to play with uh, play with the parts here to kind of get a feel of what we can do. But we're starting off with antimatter missile launchers, and like I said, I don't know what the theme of this series is going to be. If you guys can think of a good theme, that would be tremendous. And look, the plants that we start near. These are kind of like our home plants. They're very much like the green ones, it looks like. Now, oh, uh, yeah, they shoot, but I don't think they actually cause damage. They're like the green ones that we started near as the insectoid race. Now, I don't know if each of these races have a name. I'm sure there's a name for each one of them, but... Okay, so I'm just starting out. Now, the only weapons I have is that def those defense guns and these dumb fire missiles, which I'm assuming do lots of damage. Hold on, I never looked at the damage. Um... Do, 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 damage explode damage 90 I don't know if I relatively speaking compared to what we we're using before I have no idea if that's effective or not we may just have to do some serious mining here so just going into these plant wow this game you know I think it's getting prettier <laughs> that's amazing with the patches you know maybe they did add some colors here because look at this so this here is actually an old ship that's that's had uh, plants start to grow on it like mold eh oh there's some stuff in here to mine okay so all these little red dots we'll grab those so what oh wow this ship can hold what it's saying that this ship if you look on the left hand side over here it's saying that we can hold 1201 resources do we we don't have a container on it so that must be a natural trait with this race. They can carry more resources. Because uh, the last one, if you didn't have a cargo container on you, you couldn't carry anything. And I don't think we have anything like that on us. No. Wow. Okay, so yeah, that... Yeah, the ship it's, it can naturally carry 1,000 R. That's just with the... Uh, the center control piece here which is also a different shape too as well compared to the last race it is totally different neat okay so we, we need to find a bad guy here wow it, look at the map look at how much we own the center we're the race that owns the center already i'm sorry if i'm 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 so excited this is crazy so we we live in the center already we're we're kind of the bad guys <gasps> Oh, we are like, the, we're the Dominion race. Like, we, we own, we already own the center. So our job is to expand from the center. This is crazy. Because, yeah, if you remember, the last time we started, um, or the last race we played, when you start, you start off in the corner somewhere. And you've got barely any friends. Okay, these things... <laughs> These missiles, they must be long range. Oh, they're, no, they track. Okay, so it's a tracking. Oh, cool. Wow, that did uh, really well. <laughs> uh, okay, all right. Well, let's uh, let's add some, what can we do with, oh, right, we have to sell the resources. Whoa, okay, and with that gives us C. Okay, so let's go to our upgrade screen and take a look at the new weapons. Oh. Well, that's pretty limited compared to what we had before. Just not as many, you know, this might be a shorter game. I don't know, but there's just not as many parts to work with. That's interesting. So plasma condenser. Uh, okay. Okay, well, well, we'll get that. And then, really, so this is, this is it for all the different uh, parts you can get for this race? Plasma, okay, and antimatter missile launcher, plasma condensers. Okay, I, th I was told that you could build your own guns or something. I don't know, maybe we'll just be doing, I, maybe we'll just do a 20 minute stint on every single race. What do you think about that, guys? I think that's a great idea. Okay, so let's go, uh, ho actually, hold on, before we do that, let's increase the size of our ship. And uh, we'll go to, I want to fight one more guy with the weapons that we have, just to kind of get a good feel. <laughs> And, uh, oh, pause. Okay, so let's go find another bad guy. Quick, quick, quick. Let's go. Ooh, look at all. The, see all of these big guys? They belong to us. Oh, that's so cool. And we can take over these bases. <laughs> oh, so we are the dominant race. We already, in a sense, you could say, oh, ooh. in a sense, you could say, well, we've already run one. Oh, look at those, those little defense guns, eh? Look at how fast firing they are. Oh, that's awesome. 
Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, yay. Oh, goodies. Yummy. Yum, 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 yum. Okay, so I... Ooh, hey, what are you doing there, buddy? Oh, wow. So, uh, that was a... I thought it was a station, but, uh... The factory or whatever we just unlocked? That's actually a, a ship. Like, it's moving. So, do all their stations move? And uh, can I control them? Like, can I... I wonder if I could, uh... Go to command mode. Oh, I can't. I'm out of resources. Hey, let me go! <laughs> okay, hold on. <laughs> Gotta get out of here. I'm just collecting all these goodies. Just juicy, juicy goodies. Yummy, yummy. Okay. And now it wants me to... If you look on the bottom right side of the screen, it's trying to get me to do the tutorial again. Which is, uh, you know, basically run out, gather a bunch of resources, expand your ship, and build a factory. Hey, stop ramming me! Ah, oh, they like pushing around little guys. <laughs> Alright, let's get all this stuff. And, uh, you know, we could just uh, we could just go for it, right? Take the leap. Hold on. You're like, what What are you talking about? Hold on, let's uh, go to here. And uh, let's grab... Not enough resources to decrypt. What do we need? Uh, we need 950, so we could go... Well, let's go capture this station over here. <laughs> awesome. So, these stations move, which is uh, freaking cool. So, because we ro already run the most powerful race in this particular universe, we're starting in the middle. Look at... He's got engines. That's crazy. Whoa! Talk about out of nowhere. Okay, so now we should have... Oh, right. We have enough now, so let's go upgrade. We can get our factory. And uh, let's see what kind of ships we can build, too, as well. Let's go to one... Oh, ooh! T ship Tiny. That's a weird design, eh? He's got... Uh, he's got one power generator on the right side. Now, what is the weight of that thing? 14 versus 10. So I wonder if that makes him lopsided. Oh! No? Yeah, it does a little bit. If you look at the uh, center of gravity, the center of gravity is actually leaning to one side a little bit. Interesting design. Uh, ship Mini. So it's like my ship, except it only has one cannon. Look at how the, the power generator, they just throw them on a wing. And it just makes them slightly off balance, but not enough maybe to make a difference. Uh, okay, so just a fighter. So that's what we are. Yeah, that's what we are. And uh, another one, but with uh, same kind of design, but just with the one antimatter missile. Weird. Okay, so let's go back to the upgrade and get uh, 720. So, ooh, uh, almost afford that one. Okay. What? Bastards. <laughs> ah. Oh. The problem is, ah. Uh, oh, where am I? Okay, there I am. <laughs> Come here. Woo. Ah, no. Oh. I may be uh, the winning race in this game already, but uh, this is not the winning ship design. <laughs> it doesn't. This ship doesn't even turn very well. You think? Oh, come on! Ah, oh, son of a! <laughs> awesome! Ah, let's get out of here. Okay, let's just uh, clear out. Okay, so what? These guys are mad at me. Well, okay, so what's interesting about this is because we are starting in the middle, everything just outside the center is very, very strong. So the this area here would be very strong enemies, I would think. Like, we're maybe the strongest enemy in the galaxy, in this particular galaxy, but everything else... <laughs> Actually, what's interesting is this race here is the same race we were playing last time. It's the same design. I remember that ship. I remember that design. Interesting. Okay, so let's get back over to... Oh, I just want to get out of harm's way. Yes, we need to uh, redesign the ship, but I wanted to get one or two more pieces. Oh, 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 crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Ah! <laughs> Leave me alone. Oh, get him, boys. Ah! I rammed stuff. That's not good. Okay, so let's, uh, let's capture a couple more of these stations. Oh, they just... Wow, okay. Careful. Careful. Yeah, we're surrounded by enemies. So, yeah, we, we own uh, some really nice uh, real estate in the galaxy, but we are we are surrounded. I'm not even sure. Oh, there's little turrets or something. Damn it. Okay. Ooh, goodies. I love goodies. Okay, but as soon as we get goodies, we've got to sell them. Ooh. Okay, so there is... These little turrets are a problem. 
I don't this ah, okay I guess I guess the only option we have with this ship is to put plasmas on it um, let's do a quick little upgrade right away let's just uh, <laughs> oh we've all been here fast forward Okay, one of the things I noticed here is, uh, is this is a booster. Sorry, for some reason I thought this was just another part. But yeah, this is the a booster. Really interesting. <laughs> I just, the design is so different. And, you know, last time there was the three different sizes. So there's only one size of boost? Or, oh, maybe I can make it bigger and smaller? No, I cannot. Very, very weird and cool and interesting. So we definitely want to add some more turning ability to this sucker, but we can't seem to... So, I don't know, I kind of like the design. Now, the reason I chose, uh, I just did it this way, just so we could have some basic bulk firepower, because uh, to this point, we really... We, I mean, that other little ship, or the ship that we just modified, really didn't have a lot of... Uh, just basic firepower. So I think we'll do this. That'll give us a little bit better turning, I think. Haha. <laughs> okay, so a uh, few more points left. Uh, how much are these things? These things are 15p. Yeah, they will, uh, they'll put me over. That's fine. Okay, exit. Save. We're going to need some names for these ships. So this is just, you know, we're just learning. Uh, let's go to our bindings. Let's see if we can't. So left. Okay, so this needs to be left. Yeah, and the missiles, missiles right, and the uh, other little guns point defense, perfect. Okay, so yeah, it's it's a plasma, but it's, uh, I don't know, it's, maybe it's very similar to the previous plasmas, but it's maybe a bit bigger? I don't know, I don't know, relatively speaking, I have no idea. I also added some external armor, and look at how stuff really fits together nicely now. Isn't that cool? Oh, wow! Okay, out of the way! <laughs> okay. And uh, those missiles, yeah, they are tracking missiles, so I have to remember to use them. <laughs> I guess, you know, I guess we could, uh, we could just put them all on the same button. I guess that wouldn't make a difference. I think we're okay for power. So let's test her out here. Woo! The missiles at range. Uh, why are they not... Why were my missiles not firing? <laughs> okay, uh, I have to learn how to dogfight again because I, I got so used to the big ships, right? Okay, so the missiles are working and we actually do need them on the second mouse button. It just, because uh, they're, they've are they got the range on them, right? So let's see how much damage two missiles really do. Yeah, they, uh, look at them, they're getting shot down. So, uh, I could add some more strafing ability to this ship. Let's just do that really quick. So, strafing ability allowing us to fly laterally a little easier. Maybe do a couple of those. Oh, no, that puts us over. Okay, that's fine. That gives us one extra on there. That's cool. Okay, save. So, let's try that laterally. Okay, so now uh, we, still, we still can't outrange it. Oh, well, <laughs> I'm surrounded by big friendlies, so... Oh, right. Now, these little guys, I don't think they have point of fence, so... I'll try and zoom in so we can see what we're doing. Yeah, the missiles, uh... <laughs> Against shielded targets like this? I don't know if that's really going to do us much good. But, if I take that over, then... That will kill everybody. <laughs> and look, it's 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 building a ship, not a station, which is so cool. And look at it. Oh yeah, that's so cool. <gasps> okay. Uh, is this guy's already dead? Yeah. The <laughs> uh, I'm not used to flying little ships anymore. I'm used to having a lot of uh, defense mechanisms on my ship. Wow! Oh yeah! Ah! Okay! Wow! I am getting my 
was handed to me. <laughs> uh, yeah. So I wonder, actually, is there... Oh, there is three sizes of booster on here, but you start with the smallest size. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Okay, so we should have enough points to upgrade again and get the big missile launcher. Oh, yeah. Big guns. Okay, let's throw one of those on. <laughs> Holy crap. These things are... Oh, crap, Ola. These are big. Okay, kind of a first pass. I kind of I decided to go for a little bit of a design change overall. I need to get uh, upgrade my points a little bit. So something completely different from what we've done. Like we're we're getting away from this whole insectoid thing, and now we're heading towards something completely different. I have to upgrade it so that we ha uh, finishes the build, and of course we need to also add some engines. So be right back. Notice what I've done here. I'm going to try and make this a ship that flies up, intercepts the enemy, and then flies backwards while shooting its missile at the enemy. <laughs> I have no idea if that's going to work. <laughs> See, only... Now, these are the bigger missiles, right? They were really expensive to put on, so we couldn't have the plasmas on the ship as well. What a neat design. And notice it doesn't break it up like the triangles. It makes it into one seamless design as opposed to before where it would break it up and you could see each individual crystal that you put onto the ship. So this is kind of like a, I don't know. I don't know what kind of race this is yet. This is exciting. Uh, I don't know if we can actually kill anybody. Uh, I don't... Look, he's got... Oh, those are all missiles. It's using all missiles to kill the enemies. Crazy, but I just don't know if two missiles is enough to do enough damage to anything to actually kill it. We may need a lot more than that. Let's see here. Ah! Uh, see, that reverse engine's not big enough. So what I did is when I saw him, I, or when I started to engage, I started to go in reverse while firing missiles. That's kind of the MO for this ship, right? But, yeah, I don't know if that's enough. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know. <laughs> oh, let's all get this, uh, this big guy. The station. I can't do crap on my own. Uh, and these missiles... As, f as good as they are, uh, they get shot down pretty easily with point defense. So I guess this race is all about big, ugly missiles. Cool. Cool, that was kind of neat. Uh, of course, there's no goodies to pick up because my allies collected all... Like I said, we're in pretty hostile space here. <laughs> uh, see, I don't think I can even take out the one of these turrets. Let's, let's give it a shot. Let's see here. Yeah, see, those two, he's got one defense gun on him, and even, oh, wow, uh, wait, wait, leave me alone, what are you doing, dude? Okay. <laughs> oh, you just, little buggers, they just, they hit me and then they run away. <laughs> okay, see, I can't even take out a turret, I can't even take out one of these turrets, it was funny, my friend took it out, so let's try that again. I just don't, I can't do enough damage. And those missiles are too slow. <laughs> yeah, okay, so we need to change our design. Obviously, the missiles alone, that's not gonna work. So maybe we should be starting out with, uh, how much, uh, we don't have enough points, I don't think, to, oh yeah, we do, okay. So let's, let's see if we can add a couple guns here as well. <laughs> Problem is, we have no room to add any guns. Oh, oh, can you? No, that would be so great if you could fit in there. Oh, that would be so awesome. Oh, looks like our time's up. Oh, bummer. Okay, so this is this is the blue pink race. Okay, so we can't do that. This is the blue pink race, and I think next time what we'll do is uh, we're we're gonna try each and 
every race. I think that's a good plan. Somebody else had mentioned, a couple of you had mentioned that we just try a whole bunch of different races, and I think that's the plan. I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to see what weapons there are available for each of the different races and, and how they're uh, constructed. Oh, look at this. Roadhog. Get out of my way! This is road rage. Total road rage if I've ever seen it. Fight a handgun, I tell ya. <laughs> oh, there we go. Now we're doing some damage. Cooking, cooking with Crisco. I don't know if the missiles are really doing any good, but there we go. Okay, guys, I will see you in episode two of season two. Okay, take care.